All right, so we want to find out a uh, new length of a ramp here when it goes from 12 degree or 18 degrees to 12 degrees. So I'll just draw this real quick. So we have the height to a truck or wherever we're loading this. It's just H. And here's this. This is 12 degrees. And they tell us this is 10 feet. And then we have another one um, goes out here. This is 18 degrees. And they want to know how much longer this value, and I'll just call it X, is. So here's what we're going to do. So starting off, I know this angle is 90 degrees. I'll do this. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do um, law of sine. So I get sine of 12 degrees. Shoot. Um, darn it. Actually, uh... This should be 12 degrees, and this should be 18. I'm getting all mixed up here. All right, so 18 degrees over h is equal to sine of 90 over 10 feet. So cross multiply. So sine of 90 times h. Sine of 90 is just one, so it's h is equal to sine of 18 degrees times 10 feet. And with that, we get three rounds to 3.09 feet. And that's what our new H is. So H remains constant. So now that we have that, we can do um, sine of 90 over X is equal to sine of 12 degrees over 3.09 feet. And cross multiply here. So X times the sine of 12 degrees is equal to sine of 90, which is just 1 times 3.09 feet. So we divide um, x equal to 3.09 feet divided by sine of 12 degrees. And this gives us rounds to 14.86 feet. That's it. This is our solution.